Taylor here. I'm a specialist at Jacobs Trading. If you're unfamiliar with Jacobs Trading, make sure you click the link below to follow to our website and our online shop as well. Um, working with Jacobs Trading, <laughs> there are so many rocks and I love them all and there's so much information and I just wanna share some of that today with you guys. So we're gonna start doing some videos where um, I choose a stone and we'll go a little bit into depth with it um, just to get some different points and uh, see if it interests you and maybe it's what you're looking for that day. Okay guys, so today we're gonna go into Emerald. I'm about to show you my favorite piece that we have in the store. So Emerald is one of our four precious gemstones that we commonly know today. And this includes Ruby, Sapphire, and Diamond. Sometimes Emerald can even be more expensive and more valuable than Diamonds. Um, the main source of Emerald comes from Colombia and it actually stands for over 50% of the Emeralds worldwide. On the most hardness scale, it's a 7.5 to 8. So it is fairly tough but when they are making jewelry with it, it can be quite finicky in terms of faceting and um, putting the little hooks on it. And so that is another thing that adds to their value because they aren't as tough as a diamond. You have to be a lot more careful with it. Some of the oldest emeralds are just under three billion years old. In fact, it was mined in Egypt first in 15,000 BC. And with Egypt, Cleopatra, it was one of her favorite stones and it's used in a lot of her jewelry. If I could only get my hands on some of those pieces, I would be so happy. Another famous person, Elizabeth Taylor, she had a gorgeous emerald pendant and it sold at auction for $6.5 million. You know, back in the day, actually, emeralds were thought to ward off memory loss and loss of intuition. It's even said that if you take an emerald and you put it under the tongue, that you used to be able to tell the future. Emerald has been called the goddess of precious stones, and all the green of nature is concentrated within the emerald. The soft, common color of emerald is said to relieve eye strain, and in fact, it was used in glasses and magnifying glasses. Um, they said that if you put small pieces of emerald in the corners of your glasses, it would dramatically relieve your eye strain. As you can see, these do not have any because I'm poor. <laughs> okay guys, that's it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I did. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. If you liked it, make sure you press like, and if you'd like to see more, click subscribe. And we'll see you later.